Okay, ladies, it's been a rough day yesterday, rough night. Um, I'm going to do a video about being tough with your kids, loving them, but being tough. So last night, I heard that my son had taken some more weed on top of um, whatever else he was on last night, threw a soda on a guy's face. The guy beat him up, um, called the ambulance, got involved again. The police went over. And they gave him a no trespassing order over there. So he has no home. He has no job. Um, this is what drugs do to you kind of thing. I was hoping they would take him to jail so he'd have some time to get out of his system, whatever is in there. Um, we don't know where he is. Um, so, you know, he is, luckily, he is a Christian, which the truth is, he is God's son. God's got him. God makes no mistakes. So I went to church today and was just telling some of the people there what happened. We have a pastor who's praying for him. We are in prayer. I'm probably going to be fasting because some things just are like, you know, you really cannot get victory over until you do do that. Um, being thankful, praising God in the midst of it, that he's in control and that just giving him praise. So when you have kids, and my videos are about how wonderful kids are, make sure you have kids. I would never say I wish I did not have my son. I still love my son very much. And we are just going through some trials right now. And hopefully, because God's got his best in mind, this is going to teach him a few things. Um, but at the same time where he's had, either he's on drugs and a mental breakdown in the the doctors just hand out hormone treatments to left and right. So I went to his apartment. The roommates are cleaning his stuff out. I think they wanted the place anyways for themselves. I don't know. Jake had mentioned they were using him. So um, I got the paperwork and I'm looking at the medical stuff. And, you know, these doctors, they just put people on hormones and they don't care. So you get the drugs, the hormones. Um, he has never talked to me the way he did yesterday. He was being very evil and very mean, and that's not my son, that's the drugs. So if you're a mom who's gone through this with your kids, don't give up on them. Um, of course, there's boundaries. He actually threatened to kill me yesterday with my son. He said he wanted to kill me, so my life was in danger. So you have to protect yourself, but at the same time, you can pray for your kids, and you can hope they turn around, and God will deal with it. So that's what I got for now, guys, and I am just praying for my son.